done. So I'm going to be showing you what I keep in my model bag. First and foremost are shoes. I keep mine in Ziploc bags so that they stay clean and they don't get scuffed up. It's really important because when you're walking runway, the audience is on all sides and they're eye level with your shoes and you don't want them to have any scratches or any scuffs on the back that they'd be able to see. You also want to make sure you have them in different colors, nudes, golds, blacks, and the styles that are popular. That way you can pair them with the outfits you've been given. Next I have jewelry. I keep mine in a bag separate from each one. Necklaces, bracelets, earrings, and they each have their own compartment. That way I can pick them out and match them with the outfits I've been giving quickly and be able to change outfits fast. It's also important to have those in different colors as well. Bowls for summer and then silver and gold for evening wear. You have your more neutral colors, black. Next I have hair accessories. Keep them in little Tupperwares too, that way they're separate. You have your bobby pins, your hair ties, hairspray, anything that you need for your hair. And then I also have a separate pair of eyelashes in case I need those. And then I also keep lingerie tape in case I need it for any of the shirts if they're, you know, a little bit big and move a little. Next I have makeup. You want to keep that in a separate bag. That way if you have to do any touch-ups, you can just take it all with you and go. And then in there I also have nail polish that matches the color I'm wearing. Usually a clear coat, that way it matches everything, but if you have, you know, like pink and white, so you can carry a little white bottle, that way you can touch up any chips. Next I have a backless strapless bra. That way it comes in handy if you have you know, any tank tops and you don't want your bra straps to show. Also in here you want to keep any hosiery, slips, and then a, hand, a head covering. That way when you're changing you can put it over and take the tops off without getting any of your makeup on them. And they're usually about $5 from any beauty supply store. I got mine from Sally's, so they're pretty easy to find. Also in here you want scissors and masking tape, that way you can tape the bottom of your shoes when the designers give them to you, that way you're not scuffing up the bottoms. And then you also want to have a mirror and toothpaste in here as well, that way you can freshen up and get ready for the next shoot or if lunch is provided for you and you can make sure you brush your teeth and you're ready to go. And that's what I have in my mouth.